Hey, welcome to another County Com One Take video. And one take, one opportunity to show you something really cool. Today, money. it's the Gen 8 bailout bag. Cool thing about Gen 8 is, well, a lot of people don't know. 2001, we made the first bailout bag. It was a little different design. Everybody in the world copied it. People stole the name bailout bag. We got dis disturbed about it and <laughs> took a break from making bailout bags. I thought bags. it was perturbed, but whatever. Perturbed, disturbed. That's right. But... So anyway, for the last year, we've been working on this. This is Gen 8, the bailout bag, the ultimate bailout bag. Uh, it's big, uh, but it's not too big. It's good enough for a weekend. It's good for a little field trip. Let's show you what we have in ours. First of all, let me show you that. Look at that big piece of Velcro real estate there. That is six inches by four inches. That patch does not come included, so you have to buy that patch separately. So sorry, that one's mine. <laughs> Moving on, let's put open your this. own on there. Yeah. Right? yeah. Well, here, let's let's flip it around real quick. We're talking about Velcro patches because we always want to mark what's in our pockets or who does this belong to or who you're going to steal from. This is important to know. So we have two more Velcro patches. They're big too. Those are 4.25 inches by three inches long. No, I'm sorry, 4.25 by three inches. Good. Let's see. Let's 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 get into this thing. Let's open this up. All right. So let's look at the main compartment here. So I like how these zippers, they're kind of like self. Uh, what would you call that, Frank? That's uh, well, they, actually they're, got, they're they're, they're tailored. The, they got this these little uh, bellows on here that actually keeps the, the dirt and dust. And it looks really nice when it's closed like that. It's, it look you don't even see the zipper. So let's let's look at. It. There's double zippers on everything okay. in here. Oh, there's a radio. Let's get that out of there. All right, there's my water two. bottle. So I'm doing a weekend little weekend thing. So I'm putting my got some. I got some clothes in here, I got a sweatshirt, I got some shoes in here. Okay. So I haven't even loaded this down yet. Um, I've got an interior, this is all Velcro. Uh, Velcro hook. Hook and loop. Loop. I'm loop. sorry, that's loop. Yep, that's loop. This is the loop. Loop. Right. So you can put other pouches on there that have Velcro on it. Or, uh, or hook and loop or, or whatever hook, you want yeah. to call it. Yeah, so. And this side has two zippered mesh pockets. That's two, two, two good sized pockets. Yeah, let me drop a radio and just, just kind of see. Hey, yeah, yeah, no problem. So that would go right in there. Water bottle, whatever. So the mesh pockets. I like the mesh pockets because you can kind of see what's inside. Exactly. So I have USB cords and, and uh, charging cables. So in the, mine. this inside dimensions, what's, what do you think that is? That's about uh, what? Well, that would be the uh, main compartment. That's 14 inches. By oh six inches by wide. six inches by eleven inches tall. Yeah, it looks wider than six. But let's take the shoes out. Let's kind of look at the inside here. Oh yeah, yeah, it's about six on the inside. So there's a lot of room in there. All right, cool. I like this material here. So this is like a seatbelt material. It's exactly what they call it. It's Very soft but webbing. super strong. Yeah, so it's not it's not scratchy and itchy. Same so, here with with the shoulder. So the shoulder straps are two inches wide. So it's, that gives you. It's comfortable on the shoulder. However, step it up one more notch. That one more step up is the padded shoulder. Ah, strap. gotcha. Okay, so we got the, the ITW. So no, I, no. Oh, hold on a second. Okay. This is Duraflex. Oh, Duraflex. Okay. Duraflex. Duraflex hardware on there. Uh, so let's look at this. So we got. Open this thing up. What do outside, we got in here? Outside pot. Let's go into your personal stuff now. I got a, I got a magazine. That magazine you got, oh. Don't look at that dirty magazine. Don't That's a radio that magazine. Dirty. So it looks like the handles are uh, welded. They're sewn all the way through and come they come around and so they're stitched all the way so hell of a lot of strength in there yep they, and they, they stop right there at the uh reinforced at, bottom don't they reinforced bottom well look at that we're going to keep going oh, from pocket going, we'll going from pocket bottom. to pocket so that's got that same so kind that's of just tailored, a nice big pocket same kind of tailored look there double zipper okay close that double zipper okay. double zipper and the same thing here now this pocket has double zipper Oh, another uh, hook side. This is the loop. This, this is a loop side. This is a yes. loop side here. So you could put these uh, quick cases in there if you have these quick cases. They, they're velcro right out. Yeah, they pull in there. Okay, those are not included in this case. They are right? not. They're just showing. Hey, you've showing, got some stuff is that is, stuff. that's hook and loop friendly. You could put that in there. Same thing here is an embassy pen. So that's cool. Again, how big is that? My big size 12 shoe will fit in there. Oh yeah, no problem, no problem. So we're, instead yeah, of the no rulers, problem. we're no. going to use uh, 
Yep, that will work. Okay. We're using so, my shoe. <laughs> so that's 14 inches long by 2 inches wide by 8 inches tall. Besides that size, size 14 shoe. So yeah, or size 14 shoe. And then let's look at the bottom here before we flip it around. So this is a, uh, what, what's this material? Uh, shoot, I forgot the trade name for it, but it's a vinyl reinforced vinyl. It's fabric with vinyl over it. It keeps it water resistant. So if you put this Kyle down. Kyle looks like Herculite to me. I don't, not sure. But I similar product. Say. They're okay. all similar. It's a very similar product. Okay. So that's for the bottom to keep from moisture from yeah. hey, propagating up. Let me look at these handles. What's the deal with this wrap on the handles? So they're stitched with the over over wrapped with nylon, a thousand denier, and then they're bar tack. That on just each looks corner. very classy. Easy, no velcro up here. It's just simple. Okay. So I think this is going to be uh, like an overnight uh, forty eight hour bag. So I had mine at the truly was designed to be the replacement bailout bag. I had mine at the uh, at the Ritzy coffee shop this morning. Yeah, and uh, a guy comes up to me, thought it was a Tumi ba bag. Well, you know, and then Tumi's <laughs> like out of our range. It's, it's out of our range. It doesn't but have that tactical look. It has more of the you know. It has the more yes. I guess if you're going to your yacht, but this was here. I hey, wasn't going to, my going to your patrol car. Or you're going out on a little mission. You're going on to a to a yeah. secret uh, rendezvous with. Uh, Friends or whatever it is. Whatever. We don't judge. But, um, so I have a couple radials here in these end pockets here. Another another large radio here. So, so that easily fits. Or I put a water bottle there. And these, of course, have double zippers, zippers too. Double zippers. Over overkill. But, we overkill. Uh, now, I understand all the outside pockets have double zippers. All have outside pockets. Yeah, yeah. The only so, exception are those here. two little mesh zippers. Let's show that. There no go. problem putting a water bottle in there. This is a this is a large radio. It will no problem drop in there. So I have one on each side. If I, you have, choose to have a radio. So now let's get into what's over here. Oh, okay. So what do we got? This is the I call it the admin pocket. Okay. This admin pocket. Hey, got places for pens in here. I like that. One, two, hey, three. So tell me about three, the pink four, five. That's for just you know marking eyebrows and I mean uh, things like that. So, hey. Okay. Anyway, hey, got, and these pockets are not really for business cards. However, you can have a business card holder in there. Okay. These were done purposely for, these pockets are set deep in here. You can see I'm going one by one. They're deep pockets. Phone call from my girlfriend. So there we go. This is an iPhone 10. No problem. I have two of these. I drop hey, 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 hey. one for business, one for, you know, for other stuff. Oh, cheater phone. Cheater phone, burner phone, whatever you want to call it. Anyway, okay. so there, there it is. Oh, and then here, there's another little secret kind of admin okay. pocket right so there. This one, well, close that. We that's prepped just, on that, right? Yeah. That's, they don't want us to show you what's in his admin that, pocket. That's just a, another big pocket, that, but it Velcro closes Okay. like that. So Yeah. So YouTube does not want us showing what's in secret pockets. Well, hey, my phones that's don't true. really offend anybody. No, the phones don't. Just right, because of the think. color of this. but So there's, oh, how many here got? One, two, three, four, five, six of these. Little, so you can have swap. six phones on one side and six phones on the other side. Or maybe a little wallet or something. Or a wallet yeah, or whatever. Yeah. But anyway, that's kind of... Uh-oh. My music. <laughs> there you go. All right. So anyway. That's why you have... It's a real phone. phone. It's not a prop phone. phone. Okay. Not a prop phone. Right, no and, then, and then we got these uh, outside pockets. Okay. These outside pockets are very cool. So what do you have? I got, oh, I got someone that loaded me up with uh, tourniquets and wound uh, seal wound kits. Seal. Got it. So you do have quite a weekend planned. Yeah, there might be some danger involved. But okay. so I, I have the tourniquets in here, and just in case things go bad. Okay. And so, I, if I but were... hey, you could put a roll of toilet paper in here. You could uh -huh. put towels in here. You yeah. could put radio equipment in here. You could put Duct ba tape. batteries. I mean, if you were do, making just a bailout bag for your house, or earthquake kit. Awesome bag, because you know, and here with the Velcro, I, you know, I put I put a little medical. Now we could go in there. the bag, got a bunch of flashlights, and loaded it in. Would you know it wouldn't be? But I'm sure you guys have flashlights to load in here. Oh, of course. So you got a whole little. Oh, what's That's, in there? Well, oh my, you made this bag. This is our. This is our. Our little to our little tool bag. Tool bag. It's got lots of tools in here, but that does not come with it. It's just Don't. hey, this is like so. This is eight pounds of tools in here, but I can just drop that right in there. And you know, again, I got the double zippers. So hey, if one fails, you always have a second one. But really nice bag. I got to tell you, it, when it's not loaded up, it profile automatically kind of shrinks down. But you know, and, and it loads up. When it loads up, it you know it goes to where it needs to be. So let me put the shoes back in there. Okay. This is a long video. It's a big bag. It's a big bag. There's a lot of features on this bag. Hey, I'm putting this, this bag, you know, like I said, in a year. Putting yep. this radio Our in there. first bailout bag was in 2001. Wow. And now we're doing it again. This is a year There later. it is. 
been a long time coming, but hey, so long it takes for someone to embezzle this. So there it is. That is the Generation 8. Gen 8, yes. Gen sir. 8 bailout bag. Thanks for watching.